65 million years ago, a giant asteroid slammed into Earth, causing one of the worst mass extinctions in history. The dinosaurs, once rulers of the planet, were wiped out, but not all animals were lost. Some species survived and evolved to thrive in the new world. Let's explore how they made it through a disaster that even the dinosaurs couldn't. The asteroid that hit Earth was massive, about 10 kilometers wide, and struck with the force of over a billion atomic bombs. It created a huge crater in what is now the Yucatan Peninsula, and its impact had global consequences. The immediate effects were catastrophic, earthquakes, tsunamis, and wildfires that raged across the planet. But what happened next was just as deadly. The impact threw up so much dust and debris into the atmosphere that it blocked out sunlight for months or even years. Without sunlight, plants couldn't grow, and without plants, herbivores, the plant-eating dinosaurs, started dying off. And when the herbivores disappeared, so did the carnivores. Even the fierce, unstoppable T-Rex couldn't survive. But while most of the dinosaurs were wiped out, some creatures found ways to survive. The big question is, how? First up, we have birds. Now you might not think of birds as survivors of the dinosaur age, but they actually are. Birds are the direct descendants of small feathered dinosaurs. Millions of years ago, some dinosaurs started evolving feathers and some of these feathered creatures learned to fly. When the asteroid hit, their small size and ability to fly gave them a massive advantage. Birds could escape dangerous areas, travel long distances to find food, and scavenge when necessary. Unlike the massive dinosaurs, these early birds didn't need a lot of food to survive. They could live on seeds, insects, and small animals, whatever they could find. Also, many of these early birds were ground-dwelling, which means they could hide in dense vegetation or burrow into the ground to escape the worst of the disaster. Their adaptability is what helped them survive when so many other species were wiped out. Today, birds are one of the most diverse and successful groups of animals on the planet, and they owe their survival to the fact that their ancestors outlasted the asteroid impact that killed off their much larger cousins. Now let's talk about one of the toughest survivors of all, crocodiles. Crocodiles are some of the oldest living reptiles, with ancestors dating back almost a hundred million years, long before the asteroid hit. These ancient reptiles lived alongside the dinosaurs, and believe it or not, they haven't changed much since then. But why did they survive when the dinosaurs didn't? Crocodiles are extremely tough animals. They have thick, armored skin that helps protect them from predators, and they can live in a wide range of environments, including rivers, lakes, and swamps. When the asteroid hit and the climate began to change drastically, crocodiles were able to retreat to water and wait out the worst of the disaster. One of the reasons crocodiles survived is that they can go for long periods without eating. After the asteroid impact, food became scarce, but crocodiles being cold-blooded didn't need as much energy as warm-blooded animals. They could survive on very little food and were willing to eat just about anything fish, birds, mammals, even carrion. Another key factor in their survival was their ability to live in both freshwater and saltwater environments. This adaptability allowed them to thrive in a wide range of habitats, even when the Earth's ecosystems were collapsing. While the dinosaurs and many other species died out, crocodiles patiently waited out the chaos, and today they remain one of the most fearsome predators in the wild. Next, let's take a closer look at turtles, creatures that seem almost unchanged by time. Turtles are another group of animals that have been around for millions of years, surviving not only the asteroid impact, but several other mass extinction events throughout Earth's history. So, what's their secret? One of the most important survival traits of turtles is their incredible ability to hibernate and slow down their metabolism. After the asteroid hit, the Earth became a very inhospitable place. Temperatures dropped, food was scarce, and many animals couldn't cope with the harsh conditions. But turtles, especially those that lived in water, could retreat to the bottom of lakes or rivers and hibernate for long periods. Their ability to breathe through their skin while underwater helped them stay hidden from danger while waiting for conditions to improve. Turtles also have a special defense mechanism, their shell. The shell not only protects them from predators,
but also provides them with a safe place to hide when conditions get rough. In the post-impact world, where predators were desperate for food, a hard shell was a lifesaver. This ability to hide and wait things out gave turtles a major advantage over other animals. And that's why they're still with us today, roaming our oceans, rivers, and forests. Now, let's move on to small mammals, the underdogs of the dinosaur age. While dinosaurs dominated the land, small mammals, like early insectivores, which include ancestors from modern hedgehogs, moles, and shrews, were scurrying around, mostly staying out of the way. These creatures were tiny, often no bigger than a modern-day mouse, and they lived in burrows or under rocks, staying hidden from the large predators that ruled the earth. So, how did these little creatures survive when the mighty dinosaurs didn't? The key was their ability to hide and their varied diet. Small mammals didn't need much food to survive, and they weren't picky eaters. They could survive on plants, seeds, insects, and even the remains of dead animals. After the asteroid impact, these small creatures could retreat into their burrows where they were protected from the extreme temperatures and dangerous conditions above ground. And because they reproduced quickly, even if many of them died, there were always more to take their place. Take the modern rat, for example. An average mother can produce anywhere from 30 to 60 rats in a year. Well, the rats reproduce at such a ferocious rate, they can't be contained, stopped, or even slowed down. It's amazing to think that these tiny mammals, who were once hiding from dinosaurs, eventually evolved into the mammals we see today, including us, humans. In a way, we owe our existence to these small survivors who managed to outlast one of the most destructive events in Earth's history. Before we move on, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell to get notified whenever a new video gets published. It takes only two seconds, but helps our growth a lot. Finally, let's dive deep into the ocean to talk about sharks, one of the ocean's top predators that has been around for hundreds of millions of years. Sharks had already survived several mass extinctions before the asteroid hit, and they managed to survive this one too. But how? One of the main reasons sharks survived is that they lived in the deep ocean, far away from the destruction happening on land. While the surface of the Earth was devastated by tsunamis, wildfires, and freezing temperatures, the deep sea remained relatively stable. Sharks were able to continue hunting and scavenging for food, even while most of the world's ecosystems were collapsing. Sharks are also incredibly efficient hunters. They have an amazing sense of smell and can detect the slightest movement in the water, allowing them to find prey even in the dark, deep ocean. And like crocodiles, some species of sharks can go for long periods without eating, which helped them survive when food was scarce. It's incredible to think that these ancient predators who survived the mass extinction that wiped out the dinosaurs are still swimming in our oceans today. In fact, many of the sharks we see today are very similar to their ancestors from millions of years ago, making them living fossils. So why did these animals survive while so many others didn't. The answer lies in their adaptability. Each of these animals had traits that helped them survive the harsh conditions after the asteroid impact. Birds could fly and find food. Crocodiles could live in water and eat almost anything. Turtles could hibernate and hide in their shells. Small mammals could hide in burrows and eat a variety of foods. And sharks lived in the deep ocean, away from the worst effects of the disaster. These survival strategies allowed them to outlast the dinosaurs and other animals that went extinct, and they've continued to thrive in the millions of years since. Today, we share the planet with these incredible survivors who have seen more of Earth's history than almost any other creatures. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.